Good evening. Hello. Hello. How are you? Is this a Dr. Gordel? Oh, they took my license away. So... Oh, can you still get me pills? <laughs> Depends what you want, I guess. I know a guy. Um, he can do, like, a paracetamol, ibuprofen, everything, really. I want something stronger. Box of Maltesers. Oh, that sounds amazing. Can you, yeah. can I, can I have a um, prescription for that, please? Didn't I already write you a prescription for burritos? Oh, you did. <laughs> you did. <laughs> I'll have to pin it to our conversation. Um, you are you ready to I'm play? I'm firing it up. Yeah. Cool. You're always peasant in our hearts. Thank you. Bet you that's Gordel. Lazy bitch. Oh! Look! A random castle! How did we miss walking past that? Me and Gordo Lol Lol are stuck. Oh god. I think you're a pleb. Thanks, cool friend. I'm not looking forward to being this peasant. Hello? Over? Lord of Lord of over. Hello? Hello? I think... Why is uh, push to talk bound to right click? That's just so weird over. I don't really know, but I mean, at least I get to keep my fingers on WASD over. Uh, okay, great. I like how in the intro, the two people were just uh, communicating via gestures. And if we ever tried that, all we'd be doing is giving each other the middle finger over. Yes. Over. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Brilliant. Okay. Uh, so I'll tell you where I am. Um, okay, so in front of me, there are like three, three sort of uh, rectangles which I can turn, um, and they got different symbols on them. Um, I think you gotta tell me maybe the symbols that I gotta switch them to, over. Uh, okay. I am in, um, some kind of dungeon, but like, not the sexy kind, like a, the bad kind with, um, uh, with a sarcophagi. Um, I've got a load of, a load of symbols. Let's check. One, two, three, four, five six got six symbols um they're over like coffins three of them don't have a coffin over okay so i have coffins here as well which i've only just noticed um i have three coffins and there is a blood a blood-stained handprint on the three um maybe give me the the um symbols of the Ones on the coffins, over? Uh, okay, so the first one is... Uh... Dif difficult. Um... It's like... It's like a stick man, right? 
and he's he's doing the the A um, move from YMCA, right? But also, he's he's like he's jumping and he's got his legs up in the air, uh, and he has a he, ha he has a penis as well. Over. Started again already. Is this stick figure rotund? Over. Uh, no, it's um, it, he's skinny. He's skinny. Over. Uh, right, okay, give me one second. That one's got nothing, that's got nothing. So it's just these two, these two are the same, but one's missing. These two are the same, and neither of them have a coffin. What letter is he doing from the YMCA, over? Uh, he's doing the A, over. He's, he got, he's got no head as well, over. He said over twice. That's he's really bad. He's got no head. Oh. He's he's got no head. That's right. Over. How else do I describe that? It's so hard. When you say his legs are up in the air, are they kind of pointing literally upwards? Over. Yeah, like upwards and and diagonally. Um, I guess. Oh, okay, here's another way to describe it, right? So you've got you've got your stick man, but the stick man's got a um, a diamond shaped head, yeah, and you can only see from his um, from his stomach up. He's got his hands up in the air as well, but the top of his head, the top of his diamond head, has been shaved off like horizontally. Over. I got it. I got this. I got it. Yeah. Uh, what is the second one over? Sorry, say that again. I was uh, shouting at chat. Over. Tell chat to uh, shut the fuck up because shut we're trying up. to escape. Shut the oh. fuck up, Smiko. From a, from a, I didn't say that. Is it is the chicken foot with antlers? Is she waiting for me? What did she say? I wasn't even listening. I wasn't listening the second time. Stick figure does have a penis. You are right. You should have said that. So did did you say you got that one? Over. Yes. Uh, move on to the second, please. Over. Okay. So. Uh, okay, the second one, um, it's, it's a certain, no, it's an egg shape, like an oval, right? Through the, the center of it, vertically, is a line, and there are two horizontal lines in the lower half. Then on the top and the bottom, there are three lines coming out of, like, the ends, out of the vertical line, um, in, in three different directions, over... Got it. Uh, what is the third one over? Well, here's where it gets complicated because I've got two. Um, so I feel like that there must be some way to choose which of these symbols I give you, but I, I think we should just randomly guess this one, which looks like, um, you know, like a, an hourglass, like a sand based timer. It's basically one of those with two horizontal lines at the top over. Okay, I think I have it. Uh, I have a lever to the side of me, which I am going to pull now. Over. Oh. <laughs> Nothing uh, happened. Over. I pulled the lever and... All of the choices, all the ones I've chosen, have just spun around to random ones now. Over. All right. I think maybe if you've got three choices, there are only three, um, like icons that have coffins underneath. So maybe it's those. Um, in which case, it's the um, it's the the diamond-headed stick man that I described. Um, the hourglass, and then a, a new one, which I'll give you in a sec when you've sorted those out. Over. Yeah, I've got the first two over. Okay, the third one is like the, the fox from the other day, but he's got no legs. Over. Got it, over. I'm gonna pull the switch. Got it. I mean, got it, oh, got it. I'm gonna pull the switch over. Yeah, boy! 
Nice work, over. I have a door that's now open. Over. <laughs> it's double over. Okay, cool, right. I am in a new room. Oh. Um, yep. I'm in a new room. Music's just happened. Uh, it is a circular room. Um, there is a book in front of me, which I can... Um... Which I can read out to you, but I'm going to describe other things in the room for a sec. Uh, hum. Looks like some sort of weird cult thing with candles all around this, like, oval area in the center of the room. Um, to the left of me, there is, uh, like a, a picture on the wall with lots of different symbols in it. And then the, which is red, and then the... One on my right, on the right side of the wall. It's another picture with lots of dif different symbols in it, and it is blue. Um, I forgot to say that the one on the... The red one on the left, the symbols are in circles, and the one on the right, the symbols are in diamonds. Over. <laughs> it's like the worst D&D &D DM. Uh, okay. Fantastic. I'm in a, a, a big room. There are loads of doors um, that kind of look like locked versions of the, the Draugr coffins from Skyrim. Um, I've also got um, a red banner and a blue banner at opposite sides of the room, but there doesn't seem to be much more information around those areas. Maybe I've missed something, maybe I haven't. Um, I've got a door that looks like where I uh, exit, and I've also got a book in the middle of the room. Now the book reads, um, Dear L, or, or G, uh, My love for you burnt with the intensity of a thousand suns. Your beauty shines at bright, at, wait, your, bru your beauty shines as bright as the light of the stars and as colorful as the something in our garden roses as colorful as the roses in our garden love you forever be on the right hand side of the um the book there are six candles which are numbered uh one to six. Oh wait are they wait one two three four five six yeah and uh, and that's it over um right one two three one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so when I said that there's like a cult thing in the middle of the room and the candles around it, there are six candles. Um, on the book I have, it's quite long. So it says, Dear B, I have never been as happy in my life than the moment I met you, and I am honored to receive your love in exchange. I wish I could be with you forever, and the promise of your eternal love is very thrilling. But the sacrifice is too great. I cannot let you get through with. Uh, cannot let you get through with this. Maybe go through with this. I cannot let you destroy that strong, pure heart of yours. I hope you would understand the things I have done to keep you from making this big mistake. And then on the other page, it says, "I want you to remember me as I was that summer night in those rose in the rose gardens. I want you to remember I will always love you, and I won't." And I want you to remember, I will always be with you, even when I am not in this earthly world anymore. Love you forever. And then, like, the bottom bit is torn. So there's, like, I think there's a little, like, um, print of something. It's not a signature. But, yeah, so the bottom bit is torn, and then behind that page is, like, some sort of beast. Like, maybe a lion, but you can't see the head because the, the page is blocking it. Over. Uh, uh <laughs> okay. That sounds fucking nuts. Um, one thing I've noticed is that on the red and blue banners, um, there is a, like a sigil or a symbol, like on each of them. Um, I, I mean, but there are two. So there, do you have somewhere where you can select two symbols? Over. Um, I can't see anything. Um, I, I'm standing next to one of the banners, but I can't seem to, to pick anything at all. Um, 
There are one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine symbols um, on the blue banner. And then I I'd, I'd want to say in the center there is a um, an empty diamond where a symbol I think should be. And then below it, there are four empty diamonds um, on the... Give me one sec. Let me get over to the other side. My brain cannot comprehend what I'm hearing. On the other side, again, (laughs) there is nine symbols. Uh, Again, there's an empty circle and then four little circles underneath. But I can't can't seem to do anything. Um, Oh, I'm lighting candles. Okay, right. So I can light... Maybe I should light the six candles. Uh, give me one sec, let me try that. Over. All I'm thinking of is the four candles scene with the two Ronnies. Seven puzzles worth of symbols. Oh, shit. Right, there's an order. Um, there's an order to lighting these candles. I think that's what we need to, to, to figure out. Over. I missed anything? One, two, three, four, five, six. But the order's off, isn't it? Like one, two, three, four, five, six. Oh shit, maybe that's the order she needs to light them in. Oi, Flynn. Do you have six candles like around in some like some kind of circle over? Yes, over. Okay, so the the candles on my page are arranged in a circle and they're numbered, but they're numbered in a weird order, which makes me think that I have the order in which you need to light them. That's that's a good that's a good shout. Yeah, can you can you let me know which one? Um, also, I'm I'm gonna stand sort of. Um, it, uh, maybe we should do this by like time or something. Or maybe oh I don't not time but like oh at two at two o'clock at four o'clock like that one at six at twelve I I don't know I don't know help please sure <laughs> okay that's fine so the first candle is gonna be at like um, ten thirty and then the second candle is at twelve over gonna give it a half half hours <laughs> Ten thirty. the hands are in completely different areas over what what the hell are you talking about so like the, the first candle if there if there was a circle split into six with one candle at your 12 o'clock one candle at your six o'clock then you've got two candles on the left two, ta- two candles on the right the one the candles on the left are at like 10 30 and 7.30. Does that make sense? Over. Well, they're not compass points, are they? I mean, they look like that here. Maybe, maybe we shouldn't do time. Maybe just either say... <laughs> maybe maybe just go with the compass. So, like, north Okay, we're going with the compass. Uh... Oh, no, that doesn't work either. Oh, no, they, they didn't think it would. No, yeah, so, like, northeast, northwest, southeast, southwest. Over. Uh, yeah, that'll work fine because you don't you don't have an east and you don't have a west, right? But you have a very obvious north and a very obvious south. Over. Yes, yes. If you can do that, if you can let me know, we'll uh, do that. <laughs> then we can get this going. Oh. Okay. First one is northwest, and the second one is north. Over. What was the second one? Sorry. Over. North. Over. We're not doing clocks. It's too complicated, apparently. Okay, uh, done those two. Over. Okay, the third one is southwest, and the fourth one is south. Over. Okay, last two. Over. Uh, southeast, and then northeast. Over. Hey! Oh, wait, something's happening. Um... 